Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm glad to see you here. Glad that you enjoy my content. And this is going to be another video of Alaska Life. Um, this is going to be part three of Alaska Life in Seward, Alaska. Um, this is a beautiful place to work, a beautiful place to visit and stuff like that. It's a very uh, touristy type of um, place to go there because the cruise ships come in and the people go there and they shop and stuff like that. They eat there and sewer and stuff like that. And it's 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 a very good small little town. You know, it's very, very cool. Everything is um, small. Um, all the businesses are are family owned and stuff like that, operated and all that. And it's a very cool place. And I, I love them working there. And the company that I worked for when I was there was um, Icicle Seafoods. I met a lot of good people there. I still have good friends that um, that still go up there. I have one of my best friends that still that I brought up there with me and now he's living up there. And um, toodles to you, Jimmy. <laughs> And um, I enjoyed working there. So hopefully you liked this video. Please give me a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell to let you know about future videos I got coming out with. And if you wanna support my page, my Patreon page is linked below in the corner of my home page on my YouTube channel. I'd greatly appreciate it if you check that out. And hopefully you enjoyed the video. And like I said, this is part three of the series and after this one here there's no more and then i'm starting on the new series that i'm coming out um called hawaii life when i used to work in um in a lot in hawaii before i even went to alaska so i'm going to start that next month that's going to be a couple of videos and it's going to be dropping the same time on tuesdays and stuff like that so when that video has come out i'll let you guys know and all that and but thank you very much guys for watching my videos supporting me i greatly appreciate and i love you all thank you very much until the next video enjoy this one and you will love this video i can guarantee it all right let's get into the video I'm actually holding a salmon that I just caught in the river. Ain't that some shit? Holy shit. I can't believe it, I just did that. You should come over here. Uh-huh. That is so damn cool. This is the rain room. Rain gear room. We store all the rain gear and all that. This is egg house or it was egg house at one point. So they broke it all down. In the hallway. Where we're heading now is toward Fish House, where Fish House is all broken down now and everything for the rest of the season. As you will see here, it's all dark and everything. This is where they did all the filleting, all the head gutting, and all the H and G and all that. All broken down over here, all dark. As you will see, all the parts all broken down and everything. That's the other part of Egg House. Upstairs is where 
QC is, or as they call it over here, Q8. Now we're going over toward Cannery and Filet Line. Filet Line is right over here. That's the Filet Machine. Filet Line. Here goes Cannery. And here's the can machine that pumps out 228 cans a minute. Now it's all broken down and everything. Can line. Everything. It's all dark, all clean, all ready to go for next season. All the parts taken apart and everything. That's the hopper. We got more over there. Then you got down the hallway here. Got more of the machine that puts the fish in the cans. More over here. Then you got upstairs where all the cans are and everything. That's one of the freezers there. Going down to where the other freezers are. Then over here you got the end of can line. Where all the cans come in. Into these metal racks right here as you see comes off of the shelf right over here right into the can racks as you see right there and right there and then this is where they cook it all the can racks that's the office all the ovens each oven can hold 10 of those racks see here there's eight uh, ovens door to lead outside back here is what they call bright stack where the cans all come out when it's cooked. It's all get stacked, put away, wrapped, and put on the on the trucks. Very, very interesting. This is the back of the steamers. Pretty cool. And this is the end of the season. The season ended July 29th. I mean, yeah, July, July 29th, 2015. And it will start up next year in May. And this is everything over here. Very cool. Well, it's a very fun place to work. Long hours, 16 hours a day, sometimes 16 and a half hours a day. Our supervisor was Claire. She was the coolest. She wants me to come back next year with my wife. And both of us can view QCs or QAs here. So, this is where I worked for a little over three months. Bye-bye.
ambulance this far. Just in case. Trident's plant. That same point, Alaska. That's their fillet line over there. Their H and G line over there. The crab line right back there. Freezers. More freezers over there. And the dock outside. Hello, everybody. Hopefully, you liked that video of Seward and Alaska life in Seward part two. Um, hopefully you liked it, the pictures and stuff like that that I did and all that and everything. And hope you liked the video that I did with the sea lions flying by and all that inside the uh, aquarium. If you liked this video, please give me a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell to let you know about future videos I got coming out with. And if you wanna support my page, my Patreon page and my PayPal donation page is linked below and in the corner of my home page on my YouTube channel. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave me a comment below. Let me know what was your favorite video out of the series. Let me know what your favorite moment was. If you have any questions, leave them below the comments below because I read them all. I greatly appreciate it. Thank you very much, guys. Until the next video.